to change a video within um, your website, right? So if in your website you see anything like this, a video, or you see um, a video like this, any play button, I'm gonna show you exactly how to change that video, okay? So you go to the page, so you log into your website. Once you're in the back end of your website, um, you can either go to pages and find the page, or you can click here to go to the front end of your site and to see it like this, okay? Once you see your site, let's say you wanted to change something on this page, you go to edit page, okay? Then you scroll down to where you, wherever there is a video, you're going to see video light box, okay? You click on there, and then right here, you put the link to the video, whatever the link is, you know, whatever this link is. And then if it's a video, if it's, if it, that, if it, that's the only thing that he asks you for, then that's fine. If you want to put a link text, you can write link text here. And I'll show you what that looks like. You hit preview to see what it looks like. See how the link text goes next to it. And then you hit play to actually watch the video, okay? So that's that. In this case, I don't want to link text because I want it center. I'm going to remove it, hit preview. You know, you can easily change the link of the video that pop up, okay? So that's how you change it whenever you see um, a play button by itself. Now let's go ahead and look at this other page, okay? This page has videos all over the place, okay? So we go to edit page. We want to change some of those videos, okay? Okay. Um, you're going to go to the pencil here. You're going to find the um, video you want to add. So we're going to copy the link, okay? Now notice that this one has an image in the back. So it asks you to add the image. So you, you click the little red to, to remove the image. Then you find the image you want to add, like this one. Or you can upload an image. The best thing to do is to just play the video and like screenshot an image, okay? If you're using a Mac, to screenshot is Command, Shift, and 4, okay? Um, in this case, I, that's what I did. I screenshotted the image, then I made it black and white because I wanted it to be black and white, okay? So anyways, you can just get whatever image. You put it here. You put the link here, and then you hit OK, Save, and then you hit Preview to see what it looks like. Notice the image change here, right? We're going to do it again. We're going to do it on this one. We're going to remove the image. We're going, I mean that link, I'm sorry. We're going to paste the link. We're going to hit the little red to remove the image. We're going to upload a new image, okay? This one is that one, okay? So, boom. We're going to upload that image. Awesome. Let's preview it so you can see. So it's a video of a girl and couches and all that stuff. Perfect. This one. That's it. Perfect. And then there is one more we're gonna add here. We're gonna add this one, okay? So we're gonna add it here. We're gonna paste it here. We're gonna hit the red, hit add, and then we're gonna find an image or upload an image is up to you. Hit set image. We're going to hit save change and we're going to preview it. See? Now you can see everything here, okay? Now, this right here, I'm going to show you something, okay? So let's say, you know, we, we here at Creative Mind Lab, we created a portfolio for you and he has one, two, three videos. And 10 years on the line, you, you or like five months on the line, or hopefully just a week down the line, you had a ton of work and you have 10 more videos to upload. But there's only three places, right? How do you add more spaces? Okay, this pencil right here will duplicate the whole row, okay? This pencil here will duplicate the whole row. When I hover over one of these widgets and I hit the little duplicate, it duplicates the widget. I'll show you what it looks like to duplicate the widget. See, it duplicated it. Watch. And I hit preview so you can see. He added right underneath, okay? See that? So you can either do, if you're just going to add one, you can just duplicate it like this and add another one right underneath, or you can duplicate the whole row. Let me show you what that looks like. I duplicated the whole row. See, 
be added right over here. So now you have duplicate uh, rows. Um, now, notice there's a huge gap between here and here, and a little gap here. We want to try to match this gap. So now you just want to edit this row. You hit the little pencil. You go to the padding on the top, and you want to maybe put it at five. Let's see what it looks like if we change it to five. The padding on the top. See now this kind of matches this, but it doesn't quite match it yet. I need to remove a little bit. I'm just going to put two. Okay. See now this space is match. Okay. So now you can once you duplicate it, you can go ahead and edit this information. You can even delete one. Let's say you only want to add two more. Okay, you can just have two more like this. It's completely fine. All right, that's how you upload content, uh, video content that is. Thanks, guys.